Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. I've been busy studying the drawings for this cylinder block because it's not quite clear. At the moment we've got the steam from the boiler coming up through the between the cylinders to here and then what I've done is I've machined the valve plate get that on there so the steam's coming up through there also we've got the steam coming up through to the top from the boiler now from there I've got the hole drilled to line up through there so the steam will go up through that hole there into that hole there look into that chest now I've drilled a hole didn't I from here through connecting these two chambers up I've plugged that so the steam is going through there this is the safety valve on here it'll go through that hole to this chamber now that chamber has the governor on the top in the bottom you'll see a larger hole I've tapped there's a tube there that goes in there on the bottom of that it's got six holes on so the steam will come up through there and as you can see there's two holes drilled which come out there now as we got that on there then so the steam is now into the high high pressure cylinder there now what we've got to do is the exhaust so I'll try and explain how that works I've still got to drill the holes for the valves you'll have valve pushers in there and valves and then you'll have a piston going in there now what happens is the steam is in there I've made a mock-up of a valve let's take that off right so the valve is going back and forth from there with the timing of the piston with the crankshaft and that now if we take that off you've got the valve moving back and forth with the timing so the steam when it's in this chest here will go down through that slot down through the holes in there to the end of this piston so the piston is being pushed to this end so the steam that was in this end will come out of that slot into that channel on the bottom of the valve and over into the exhaust slot now from the exhaust slot we have to get the high pressure steam into the low pressure chest so how we do that is just there I'll mark it because the slot is further than that slot we have to drill a hole here and then we've got to line that up and drill through there at an angle up through the casting into the low pressure chamber so from the middle of there to there and then the steam will be in there and then the same thing happens again it's a bigger valve if 
valves moving like this and then the same thing will happen the steam will go down there through the holes there push the piston to the other end and then the steam will be pushed out of that slot into that exhaust slot now from there we need to get the exhaust out so what's got to happen I'll move that there we have to drill a hole through here right in the corner there downwards between the cylinders and then from the back you've got a hole coming down like this and then from the back a hole in there to meet I'll just move the camera and show you right in that area there so there'll be two holes threaded for studs a larger hole which is the exhaust hole so it goes in square there to meet the hole going down through there so that's what we've got to do now so this is quite complicated but we're getting there and there will also be a tube from there going into the bottom of the chimney right what I'm trying to do is drill the exhaust hole from the high pressure over to the low pressure Yes, there we are. You can see the hole. That is now going from the exhaust in the high pressure up through and into the low pressure. Right, so now we've got the exhaust coming up through from that there to there into the low pressure chamber next thing we got to do now let's take that off now look so you can see that hole there will be going up through there to there the next thing now so we got the steam to that side now the exhaust from this side has got to go down through there drill down between the cylinders and come out the back so that's what I'll do now right I'm set up to drill the hole down to that mark there if you can see it In the drawer and it says I could drill right through and plug the bottom if need be but I'm hoping I can drill this to the depth and join the next hole through that way on flat there and drill that hole there hopefully we'll be meeting up with the bottom of that one right now I'm going to drill down through and try and meet the hole that I've drilled from the exhaust port up there it's 
keep your fingers crossed. Take that out and have a look at it. So there we have the exhaust from the low pressure exhaust coming out the back. I'll just move the camera. I fed a piece of wire through there so you can see. There we are. So that piece of wire, see the top moving? I'll just pull that out now, look. If I can, there we are. Great. So on the back of there, you can see I've drilled. That's the exhaust hole, which then will have a piece of pipe going to the bottom of the chimney. Great. So that's both now the uh, steam ways coming up through the cylinder from the boiler through the valve plate up through there into the top then through these uh, steam ways into there and then also we've got our exhaust going through there, up through there into the low pressure and then down through there and out the back. I'm happy with that, that's great. I'll leave all this part for later. The next thing I've got to do is sort out the um cylinder covers both ends because i've got a drilling tap some holes right there to fix them too and when i've done that i've got to hone the um cylinders and then what i'll be able to do will be to make some blind bushes take all this apart drill and silver solder the blind bushes into the boiler and put all that lot back together Bet that on some steam sealer and that. And the, all of this will be in one and the smoke box onto the front. So it's good, slowly coming on. It's a very long job. So thank you everyone for subscribing to my channel. And those that think you like what I'm doing, please subscribe to my channel. And join me as I build a two-inch scale Fowler Showman's traction engine.